Hi, I'm Dan Gildersand, voice of uh, Spider-Man and Bumblebee. Ooh, I'm here at RetroCon here in Oak, Pennsylvania, and we are having a ball. And I want to thank all the folks at uh, Megapodtastic. It's a Megapodtastic podcast. The story of Crazy Joe was torn from yesterday's headlines, and it's as terrifying as tomorrow's. Good morning, Megapodlings. It's Crazy Joe coming to you from RetroCon. Yes, RetroCon is back. It took a break last year, but it's back. And uh, I'm sitting. Look at this. Look, look over there. It's it's Scott Derby. He was drawing commissions for a young child a little while ago. I was? Why, well, I, I was, but I, <laughs> I signed your name to it, though. That's part for the course. We're currently in the, the Muppet Stuff booth. There's Chris's friend. He's been yeah. he's been tasked with running the Muppet Stuff booth while Chris gallivants around the convention. But, but Chris is actually here right now for a hey! rare moment. And we are out looking for a Goku Funko. I gotta go out on this floor and find a Goku Funko Pop this, for. Yeah, this is Muppet stuff, right? This is Muppet. I don't look. It's not for me. I'm not a. I don't like anime. You're supposed to be finding <laughs> the Dragon Balls, not the Goku. Yeah, I, I don't like anime. I don't uh, know. I don't know. I know two things about uh, Dragon Ball, uh, Jack and shit. That's what I know I about know Dragon ball, ball. And the guys over there. And there's a Z. Yes, and my That's friend it. Rose wants something signed, and I've been tasked with finding it. So. The quest begins to find a Goku Funko Pop. I'm sure you'll find it somewhere. Hopefully. Hopefully. Potentially. But I would yes, much rather can. buy, even though it's plastic, this Jim Henson Hour lunchbox. That's more my speed. It would be better if it was metal. But they didn't make metal lunchboxes then, so it is what it is. Let's go find a Funko Pop. All right, here's some Funko Pops. So they have the one we have been tasked to find. Hey, how are you? Hey, how are you? All right. Does he have the one Rose has requested? Oh, and somebody came by. It does not appear so. No Goku Funko Pop. What the heck? Gotta keep looking. Here's the back side of Funko Pops. Let's go around and get to the front side. Hello. Look at that Spock. I'm tempted by that Spock. Right. There's some Funko Pops, but they're a little, they're priced high, I can tell. And I was given a price limit. We are looking for under $30. Wow, look at that board game. Superman Superboy, that's exciting. Game. All right, here's some Funko Pops. What do we have? Nothing yet. No, that is a negative. It's Scott Derby. It's Sam! It's Dave! I have been given a task. I am to go out on this floor and find a Goku from Dragon Ball Z Funko Pop. Have you seen any in your travels? Yes! Alright. The chance is right there at the big Funko Pop castle. The Funko Castle. Let's check it out. That's really your task? Yeah. Rose asked me to find her one. Okay. That's your task. Here we go. There are a lot of Funko Pops here. Hopefully, 
we will fulfill our mission. Is there anything particular? We found one with silver hair, but Rose is specific. She really wants the dark hair, so unfortunately this isn't going to work. The search continues. All right, our search continues. That's a really exciting lemon shirt. Do you have any Funko Pops? A couple. We have been tasked with finding a Goku from Dragon Ball Z Funko Pop. Oh, are you serious? Yes. I sold it last week. Uh, I'm not even, I had a whole collection. I sold them all last week at the <laughs> Scott Show. Uh, we must we must search this floor and find one for Rose. I think you'll find one. The search continues. But hey, we got to see Booth Babe Greg, and that is a joy always. <laughs> Always enjoy. Hey, look, it's Kyle. Hi, how are you? From the Fandom Spotlight Channel. That is where I am from. And also the voice of RetroCon. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to RetroCon 2021, day two. Kyle, do you know where on this floor we might find a Goku with dark hair Funko Pop for our good friend Rose? Um, I would say I have no clue. And but keep looking, there's the so much continues. stuff. There, there's. The, the vendors, it's amazing how much stuff you can uh, basically, you know, spend your mortgage money on right here. So. Then the search <laughs> continues. Thank you. Oh, man. I'm tired, Joe. Let's stop looking for the pop. Let's go lay down somewhere. That sounds like a good idea. Let's do that. I got my PJs. I got new PJs last night. Oh, you keep wearing them. I Why will. aren't you wearing them now? She wouldn't let me. Oh. Look, Barry wants to say hi to you. Oh. He's so cute, we can't bear it. Look at that, he's wearing a shirt, but it looks like he's barely wearing anything. Well, I don't see Funko Pops, but that's amazing. If only I had a spare $600 and room in my home for it, because I also don't have room in my home. I would want that. My beautiful wife, Christine, would certainly enjoy the Crystal Falls. Again, where would we put it? it? Doesn't make me want it any less, though. See Funko Pops. I didn't have it on the but I was a kid, I'm not gonna have None of them are Dragon Ball Z. Oh, what's this? What is this? Could this be? No, that's Vegeta. I do not know my Dragon Ball Z at all. I, I'm not an anime fan. But we shall endeavor to find this for Rose. And now Darth Vader's here. Hopefully he doesn't get in the way of my quest because he does not scare me. But that last table, they did not have the dark-haired Goku. Absolutely. They, they sold out yesterday. Oh, no. I have to get past 
not only Mr. Fett, but his paparazzi. Excuse me, cutting through, cutting through. All right, this quest is not going so well. I don't want to go back to Rose empty-handed, but we are not finding what we are looking for. All right, thank you, good luck. Check out this variant of Triclops. I've never seen that before. It's exciting though. All right, the quest continues. I see Funko Pops. I see Funko Pops. Do they have it? Is the question. Let's sort through here. Once again, the search has turned up cold. We've got nothing yet. And I gotta tell you, I'm seeing less tables filled with pops than I have at previous conventions. Previous conventions, it's just been like a pop bonanza. But I'm seeing a little bit less today. So, wow. There's already a Spider-Man No Way Home pop out. I didn't know that movie doesn't open for two months. Oh, look at that Max Headroom puncher though. That is awesome. All right. Stay focused on the quest. Unfortunately, we're running out of pops. Disappointing as it is, we're running out of pops. Well, it appears we are failing in our quest, but we have found Freud. Hey, what is that? There? We found Freud. What is that? That's something. Is that a camera? That is a camera. Oh, it's going to take my soul away. You can't catch me. I'm wily. <laughs> and I'm old and tired and I need to sit down. <laughs> have you seen anywhere on this convention floor a Goku, and I keep wanting to say Grogu. It's not Grogu. Goku from Dragon Ball Funko Pop with dark hair. I have not, but I just got in the door. All right. Will you let us know if you do? Absolutely. It's for Rose, the promoter of the show. She okay. wants one. All righty, no problem. You don't have to duck. We've, I, we've already got your soul. Oh, we've damn already you. Got it. God damn you. But we'll sell it back to you for $19.95. Okay. Looks like Kylo Ren's about to challenge Boba Fett for the throne. Oh, no, no. Kylo Ren's just posing for pictures. I thought there was a conflict of brewing, but it's just photos. And our quest has brought us to the end of the floor. And I have found no Funko Pops for Rose, which is incredibly, incredibly disappointing. I hate to go back and tell her I got nothing but I've got nothing part of the problem is 
Everyone seems to have sold out yesterday. So let's take the walk of shame back and let her know. Serpentor's throne. Hey, William Cad here. Believe it or not, you're listening to Mega Podcasting. And we'll see you every week at the same time in the same place. Be there or be square. Well, unfortunately, we failed in our quest. But we can check out the cars. Look, there's the Jurassic Park car. There's some kind of white car. I don't know what this is. Lotus Esprit. I don't know. I'm not a car guy. That one, that one I don't know. Here we have a DeLorean. Now, you know, my friend, if you watch my videos in the past, my friend Tom is usually here and brings his DeLorean. But this year, he couldn't make it. So this is a different DeLorean. This is not my buddy Tom's DeLorean. But it's still very, very cool DeLorean. There's a Ghostbusters car. Not not the Ecto one, but a Ghostbusters car. And over here we got some free video games. Now look, these video games are cool. Because all these ones that say the game is a foot on them have like a thousand games. You can find crazy games on there. I found an Uncle Traveling Matt doll. That's really unusual you don't see that very often there's gobo it's our boober it's boober but that i don't remember last i got him gonna have to ask for a price on that one mm, black hole puzzle black hole i like the black hole hey joe you, you finding anything good here at the convention no well that's too bad oh old issues of starlog magazine four dollars each this kind of thing is very tempting to me because i loved starlog magazine as a kid i think i had this issue i think i had this issue it's amazing you look back i'm pretty sure i had this one a lot of these covers bring back memories I'm going to sit, I'm going to sit in the throne, I'm going to sit in the throne, I, I'm the ruler of Cobra now, all right, too much pressure, I, 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 I'm giving it up, I found ninja reptile weapons, ninja reptile weapons, there you go, Freud, we have taken pity on you, we Stop it! pity on you. We want to return your soul. Don't return my soul. We want to return it. We want to return it like Spike in season seven of Buffy. You get your soul back. And now you get to live with the guilt of everything you've done. Ah, it tastes like mint. Yeah. All right. I am a volunteer here helping out. I'm going to be at the front desk now giving out raffle tickets. See? Volunteer. So now it is my turn to go up to the front here and hand out raffle tickets as people enter the convention. Let's go do that. This is where I will be for the next two hours giving out raffle tickets as people enter the con. Look, R2 is carrying Grogu. Are, are you taking care of him, R2? You taking good care? I don't know, he shook his head. I hope that I hope that doesn't mean no. Well, I'm powerless to stop him. That is going to be the end of my day at RetroCon. It is time to go home. But oh boy, it's been a good time. So everybody, keep wearing those pajamas. Keep wearing those pajamas with the plastic feet. Keep wearing those pajamas. Tell everyone you need. Keep wearing those pajamas with the back door flap. Keep wearing those pajamas. Don't open it to trap. Oh, it's a trap. 
Some people call them bitches. Some people call them jammies. So they can come embroidered with big money and no whammies. They can have a hundred tiny commander and damas. But no matter how they look, just keep on wearing those pajamas. Keep on wearing those pajamas. Keep wearing those pajamas. And now we're having fun. Keep wearing those pajamas. And now the song is done.